Okay, now we have one more rule in triangle called MN theorem. Theorem is like this. We have here triangle ABC, a line through vertex A meets opposite side BC at D. D divides uh, uh, BC in the ratio M upon N. Here we have uh, BD upon DC is equal to M upon N. Angle between line and BC is theta. This angle is theta. Okay, and uh, line divides uh, angle A uh, such that angle BAD is alpha and angle DAC is beta. Okay. Then we have here uh, uh, two statements for uh, MN theorem, two formulas for MN theorem. The first formula is M plus N cot theta is equal to M cot alpha minus N cot beta. Okay. Now here we have uh, side AD common between triangles ABD and DAC. So clearly here we will be using sine rule. Okay, right? जब एक साइड दो ट्रायंगल्स में शेयर होता है तो हम जनरली साइन रूल यूज करते हैं वी यूज साइन रूल फॉर ट्रायंगल्स ए बी डी एंड ए डी सी ओके इन ट्रायंगल ए बी डी यूजिंग साइन रूल वी हैव एम लैमडा अपॉन साइन अल्फा दिस इज इक्वल टू नाउ कैन वी गेट दिस एंगल इन टर्म्स ऑफ थीटा इसको थीटा के फॉर्म में निकाल सकते हैं This angle is 180 degree minus theta. Okay, so angle B will be theta minus alpha. So we have here AD upon sine of theta minus alpha. Okay, now we use sine rule in triangle ADC. In triangle ADC, we have n lambda upon sine beta. This is equal to AD upon this angle, and this angle is one eighty degree minus uh, beta plus theta. Okay, sine of one eighty degree minus this is equal to sine of beta plus theta. So we have here sine beta plus theta. Okay, now what we do? We divide uh, this result by this result. We have. Uh, M upon sine alpha multiply by sine beta upon n. This is equal to sine of beta plus theta upon sine of theta minus alpha. Okay, na? Okay, now we cross multiply and simplify. We have uh, M sine beta. Multiply by we expand sine theta minus alpha. We have here sine theta cos alpha minus sine alpha cos theta. This is equal to we have n sine alpha multiply by we expand this. We have sine beta cos theta plus sine theta cos beta. Okay. Now on both sides we divide by sine theta, sine alpha, sine beta. दोनों sides पे हम sine alpha, sine beta, sine theta से divide कर लेते हैं. So we get here m multiply by cot alpha, okay, minus m multiply by cot theta. This is equal to n multiply by cot theta plus n multiply by cot beta okay so from this we get m plus n cot theta this is equal to m cot alpha minus n cot beta so this is first formula theek okay? hai this is uh, a uh, formula for mn theorem now second formula for this theorem is inside bracket m plus n multiply by cot theta is equal to n cot b minus m cot c now how we get this here we have angles b and c okay so what we do here here we replace uh, angle uh, beta and write this angle in the form of uh, theta and Angle C, and we write angle alpha in the form of uh, angle uh, theta and uh, angle B. Okay. Now in triangle ADC, we have uh, beta plus theta plus C is equal to 180 degrees. So beta plus theta is 
180 degree minus C. Okay, sine of 180 degree minus C is sine C, and here we have m multiplied by sine of beta is 180 degree minus theta plus C. So we have here sine of theta plus C. Okay, now in triangle ABD we have uh, alpha plus B. Plus 180 degree minus theta is equal to 180 degree. Okay, so theta minus alpha is angle B. So we have here sine B in denominator. Okay, and angle alpha is theta minus B. So we have here n multiplied by sine of theta. Minus b. Okay, now expand sine theta plus c and sine theta minus b. Cross multiply and divide both sides by sine theta, sine b, sine c. We will get this result. Second formula. ठीक है ना? क्या करना है? Sine theta plus c and sine theta minus b को expand करना है. Cross multiply करना है. Then uh, divide both sides by sine theta, sine b and sine c. ठीक है ना? आप ट्राई करके देख लेना आपको ये फॉर्मूला मिल जाएगा ओके नाउ लेट्स फाइंड सम एप्लीकेशंस ऑफ एम एन थियोरम 